directly compares two things using the words like and as. I slept like a log. I'm hungry as a horse. Your love is like bad medicine. Exactly. That's Bon Jovi. OK. His hair is awesome. Moving on. Metaphors are different from similes. <laughs> I've been called a germaphobe, but I do find a single sneeze acceptable. It could be caused by dust, allergies, or really whatever nasal irritant floats your boat. However, during flu season, a second sneeze means a plague is upon the land and is every man for himself. Where do you think you're going? Away from you. Why's that? I want to live. I'm not sick. Get back in your seat. No, thank you. You know the rules. You can't leave without a hall pass. May I have a hall pass? No, you may not. Now get back in your seat. Rules are the pillars of society. I love rules. But what benefit are rules to a dead man? Excuse me. Do I look like I'm getting sick to you? You look a little pale. OK, good. That's normal. Now, I understand Sheldon is an exceptional child, all right? But when he willfully disobeys the order of a teacher, there needs to be some consequences here. Oh, we couldn't agree more. What kind of punishment are you thinking? Well, Mary, in a case like this, a few days of detention. Really? That seems a little harsh. Oh, detention's no big deal. Now, my principal used to whoop my ass with a paddle. That got my attention. Oh, yeah. Those are the days. Still have mine. Ah. Oh, Spanky. <laughs> got a real nice grip on that thing. Yeah, George, I had the equipment manager over at the Astros make this for me. The holes in it cut down on wind resistance. Smart. But these days, you have to have a consent form to whack the kids. I don't know where this world's headed. You ought to get one of those when Georgie acts up. Like you never thought about going upside his head with a slab of wood. You know, there was a time this thing gave me tennis elbow. Sheldon, come on. Where'd he go? That away.